completely allowed to change the constitution to stay in office. That's the question being sought to voters in a referendum in the Central Asian Republic of Azerbaijan on Wednesday. The country has become a major supplier of gas to Western Europe. President Ilyam Aliyev took over from his father and opponents said let him stand again to be undemocratic. Tom Esmond reports from Azerbaijan. This country may be rich in energy, but for these villagers, gas still has to come in bulky, heavy canisters. The gas main has been broken for 17 years, and there's still no prospect of it being fixed anytime soon. As my job, it's been growing rich farms, while the gas and oil it pumps to Europe. But not everyone in this country of 8 million is getting a share of the profit. Most of it has gone on plush building projects. Little of it reaches the 20% of people who live below the poverty line. Now, President Ilham Aliyev wants people to allow him to stay in office for more than two terms. Some people see the referendum as an event which will undoubtedly weaken democracy. Much depends on how many people turn out to vote. But the government says it's offering choice and providing people with a brighter future. And it might not take much to convince the people. These builders are victims of the global economic crisis and have been out of work for months. It's not for us to decide who will become president. That decision is for someone else. Ilham Aliyev won elections in 2003 and in 2008 with more than 75% of the vote. And opponents say allowing him to stay in office longer than two terms is undemocratic. His father, Haydar Aliyev, the former president, is pictured everywhere, and critics say the Aliyevs have used all the country's oil wealth to turn a democracy into a virtual monarchy. The government is effectively using the oil revenue to support the dictatorial rule. But any suggestion of autocracy is rejected by the government. There's no democratic play here. As for the referendum, I see no problem with changing the constitution. Even some Western leaders have asked to change the rules so they can stay in office for longer than two terms. Many of the poor are indifferent to politics, but all they ask is that whoever does rule the country Gets the gas pipe working again. Tom Hasselmont, BBC News, Azerbaijan. Right, let's take a look at the sports news now.